What's up guys, Iceman here. I'm doing a Gears of War 3 commentary over some Brothers to the End gameplay with a good friend of mine, Chaos Enemy. Uh, his link will be in the description if you want to check out his channel. But anyways, let me get that spiel out of the way. I have literally 17 minutes to be at work. That means I have to finish this commentary, render and upload, so I'm going to be a little bit late for you guys today. But uh, I've been on a streak, you know, I haven't missed a day upload, and uh, I don't plan on doing so. So... Anyways, guys, the main reason I came on for this quick video was to let you guys know I'm making some big moves. I just purchased a Blackmagic Intensity Pro, so my quality is going to be nice and super sexy. I probably have the sexiest quality in chaos, but that's besides the point. Uh, I need to make sure I get the two HDMI cables. I'm going to go get those today so everything's ready so I can just hook it up right when it comes in the mail. Um, I'll go ahead and do a... Uh, I won't do an unboxing of it because, I mean, if you guys want me to do an unboxing of it, I will, but there's been so many Blackmagic unboxing videos, I don't even think another one on YouTube is even necessary. But anyways, guys, one of the good features about the Blackmagic is, is that I will be streaming in just perfect quality. Um, it's going to stream uncompressed. Uh, there is no codec that's going to go ahead and resample my quality. So the quality for the Black Magic stream wise is very good. Recording wise is even better than the HD PVR. And it's the same price, really. Um, the only thing that you're paying more with the Black Magic is the two HDMI cables that you need to buy. Now those can run you twenty bucks a piece, but I'm just gonna go to GameStop and get the ten dollar ones. I'm gonna go ahead and buy one of them and my friend's giving me one for free. So I'll have my two cables for ten bucks, which is pretty good. And uh, another another thing is I've switched from Twitch to YouTube. I haven't really switched, but majority of the time I'm going to be streaming on YouTube. Now, if I'm just fucking around and I don't want to make a video out of my stream, then I'll just stream on Twitch. But uh, basically, guys, just follow me on Twitter if you want to keep active with my streams. Um, I post every time that I'm about to stream on Twitter. Anytime I'm doing an open lobby, which I will be doing every Wednesday. So get ready for my open lobbies on Wednesdays, guys. Follow me on Twitter if you guys want to play with me, you know, get in a couple matches with me. Follow me on Twitter, guys. It's the best way to keep in touch of when my live stream schedule will be up and going. Um, another big thing is is my clips, guys. I've been hitting clips lately. And for those that are in my live streams and actually pay attention to my live streams, I've been flashing my clips through my live streams sometimes. So you guys get a sneak peek. So uh, that's good. Another benefit that the live streamers get that the other people that don't watch my live streams get you know um but yeah i'm really excited to put out my gears 3 montage number three it's gonna be sick i'm saving these clips up for a while now and i hit like four or five clips just yesterday and uh my standards are going up a lot more i got a new 22 inch gaming tv it's got a gaming mode on it so it's reduced the uh, response lag to my tv and I've been playing so much better ever since I went from a 27-inch Vizio to the 22-inch Samsung with the gaming mode. And once I get the Black Magic, it allows me to play in HDMI, which uh, should also reduce some of the response delay to my TV. So, guys, I'm just going to be cracking skulls. This gameplay was actually recorded on my 27-inch, and I'm still doing pretty good. Um, I can definitely notice a big difference because I sit fairly close to my TV, and I Watching my face cams on my uh, 1v1 series which pretty much showed me that I move my head back and forth way too much while I'm playing. And I shouldn't have to move my head at all, you know. You should just move your eyes. Barely any. You, should, you know, you really should just focus in the middle of the TV and barely move your eyes left or right. You shouldn't have to move your head at all. And if you catch yourself moving your head, uh, your reaction time is not going to be as fast as someone that uses their eyes. Um, so that's another big plus for a smaller TV. That's why all those MLG guys are always playing on the 21 or 22 inch TVs. I can't remember what it is. But uh, yeah, the smaller the better guys. I mean, some people play better on a big TV. I, I get it. It is a preference. But I've always played good on a small TV. All my Gal 1 clips are from a 19 inch box TV from like 2008. Um, I've always done good on small TVs. I don't know. I don't even know why I got the 27 inch, honestly. But uh, yeah, I'm definitely uh, seeing an increase in performance in my gameplay. And uh, I can't wait to put out that Gears 3 montage number 3 for you guys. Basically, we are just crushing right now. It's seven lives to their two lives. Uh, they don't stand a chance. 
I was waiting for him to pick up Boom Shot, but he already saw me. But yeah, guys. Basically, I brought you guys on to let you know when my open lobbies are. Wednesdays, I'll let you guys know that I got the Black Magic, better quality, uh, new TV. Basically, just giving you guys an update video, keeping you uh, guys posted that I am trying to improve my channel and better myself in this YouTube uh, hobby of mine. So, um, can't wait to do a little quality test of my Black Magic. This commentary is wrapping up, guys. I got to get to work. It's 4:50. I got to render and upload this video. So uh, please leave a like and be sure to follow me on Twitter to uh, get uh, the time of my open lobby on Wednesday. Later, guys. Coming after me. He's on me. But he's... Right there, this guy's taking, ladies and gentlemen.